Two teenagers have been fined £1,000 each by police who discovered an illegal rave taking place at empty flats in Manchester yesterday. Officers say around 100 people were breaking Covid rules at the event in Shude Hill. To football now and in the Premier League, leaders Liverpool were held to a one-all draw by West Bromwich Albion at Anfield. Jurgen Klopp's side appeared to be cruising to victory after a brilliant goal from Sadio Mane just after 12 minutes. But with just eight minutes left, Semi Ajayi equalised for the Baggies. Earlier, Burnley lost 1-0 to Leeds after this Patrick Bamford penalty. In Rugby Union, Sale lost 23-26 to Wasps, that's despite leading at half-time. A 13-year-old snowboarder from Cheshire has made an impressive start to her international career. Mia Brooks from Sambach came second in a Europa Cup competition in Switzerland. The International Ski Federation says it was an incredible debut, particularly as her coach had to go home before the event due to a Covid travel ban. Now, a number of minor roads were flooded in the northwest today. This road at Adlington in Cheshire was one of those which became impassable and rail services between Morecambe and Skipton were cancelled for much of the day. But in general, our region appears to have survived Storm Bella relatively unscathed. Will that continue? Here's Kay Forster with the weather. Good evening. Well, last night we had the wind and the rain and now things are set to get a lot colder over the next few days. Ice could be an issue tonight and there will be a few wintry flurries around as well. We've already seen a few snow showers across the Pennines through today. These will continue through the evening, could give us a covering here. And then later in the night, we're going to see another band of rain, sleet and snow pushing into western parts. We could see a covering here by the end of the night as well. Elsewhere, it's mostly dry tonight, but it will turn quite chilly with temperatures close to freezing. It could be a bit of ice first thing in the morning as well and then tomorrow all of that will start to shift its way southwards as we go through the morning so it should clear away it will be dry for most of the day then some nice sunshine around as well with temperatures up around three or four celsius but we stay generally dry for the next few days but it is turning colder highs of just three to four celsius i'll be back just after the 10 o'clock news hope you can join me until then have a very good evening good night